desktop view when I click on mobile view it's normal as you can see in this video we'll see how we can add multiple color in a single row in HTML like using CSS we'll create a multiple column in a single row for desktop view only like you want that view only for desktop so let's see how we can do that using CSA first we will create a div which is body I will create a div that is the main div and I will give it a name class row okay now I want to create two div inside it one for images and one for text like i want to do that okay and i want to name it shop div okay that's simple shop div that's a very simple i haven't done anything now i will add an image that the image i have added and in this i will add a heading and i will add a paragraph paragraph okay now we did it now view this page like you can see image is on top and text in in bottom like I haven't added I haven't added any CSS. So let's see how we can do that. Like I want my image in the left side and text on right side. It will be in one row. I will go to here. I have created a style dot CSS for the CSS file and I have linked it here. Now I go to CSS. I want to give a body a margin of 10 picture. Now I've created two class one is row and another is sub div. Okay, so in the row, I will what is the main property of CSS to making a row flexible? Like you can add two or more column in a row that is display flex. When you add this property, you will see what will happen. In display, what happened? Like the number of div inside the number of div inside a row that is in a display flex, it will align every div in one. Like it don't take a size. Like if I added another div here, it will be also come in one line. I will see. I will add a heading hello yeah it's coming here hell I have only written hell not hello you can see but what we want we want only two columns how we can do that we, we just go here and display flag there is a sub div we have created I will first remove that div. I don't know sub div we have created the name of sub div and we need to add some property in it that will be width, width will be 50 percent because i want to row after adding ship div, sub div like you can say image is still up so we need to give image a size width i want to give Yeah, now it's hard hundred percent means like the width of the image will be same as with the width of div. Now we'll add some margin padding to our sub div. I will add padding for twenty picture. Make it much better. Here yeah, you can see. And I will add a button here.
you can see i have created two columns in a single row with using only css and the main property of that is the main div property should be display flex and sub div should be the width you wanted like i want two column inside one though i give width 50 percent okay but one thing is here you can see like when you inspect in mobile view Yeah, it's not look good. But I don't want it. What I will do, I will add some CSS property that with that we call media only screen. But it do like you need to set the minimum width or maximum width on which you want to apply this CSS. I want it in only on a screen that's minimum width it's under picture yeah in mobile view you can see first column is on up second is down and when you go on desktop view it's fine you can change the width like here my if i increase my screen width beyond 600 pixel because it's 653 it's showing two columns so that's how you can do it. You can sh set a minimum width or minimum screen. Like you can, if you want to some specific CSS on mobile view, so you can add mad max width. Like this CSS will work only to the width of 600 pixel. So it, you can see, I have created two columns in one row using these CSS only, and it work only on desktop view when i click on mobile view normal okay, you can see that's all thank you for watching please like and subscribe